Hey there folks, Rinny MC here, and welcome back to Let's Play East 8 Lacrimosa of Donna. In the last part, we finally got Donna! Yay! And now we need to go do some quests. So, there was just an update before I started this, so hopefully some of the issues I've been seeing are fixed. I'm really hoping. Anyways, let's have a humble given the snowflake soap that we picked up. Hmm, is that? This owl produced a snowflake soap. Hummel snatched it up. Ah, so it is soap. I would have given up hope that I'd find any on this cursed island, but... You have excellent timing. I'll gladly take this. Um, what is there to wash? No. That's right. Yeah, so let's leave it at that. Transport can never leave any traces on their packages. It's of dire importance that we keep ourselves clean. A sensible and helpful gift, indeed. Hummel's approval increased. Hummel gets five strength, and Idol gets two strength. Pretty useful. And let's talk to him about egg delivery. Hmm, about that. Allow me to explain. First, I need to take a look at something. I've hidden it beneath the ground. Er, obviously, it's an egg. Someone across it on the beach near the village. Um, is that a primordial egg? Yeah, that's what I figured. Laxy told me this egg belongs to a pterosaur. Either way, an egg this size could feed a lot of castaways. First, I thought we should just crack it open and eat it. But apparently that's not an option. Feel a surface. Adol reached out his hand and touched the egg. Hummel was cradling. Faint pulse could be felt within. Feel that this egg has already been fertilized. So if we keep it here, the offspring will ins yeah, the offspring, in offspring inside will die before it hatches. I want to bring this back to its nest, but well, I can't do that on my own. I mean, look at the size of this thing. That's why I'm asking you to help me out. Sure. I'll help. You're not gonna ask why we're doing this? Hmm, you're rather compassionate. Still, I appreciate the help. Thank you. Now then, pterosaur primordials tend to build their nests in high elevation areas. With that in mind, I don't remember seeing any nests on Gendarm. Must be in the island's northern region. Let's transport this package. We get the pterosaur egg, so it's gonna be a little bit before we can safely, easily do this. So we can do it, it's just right now it involves a lot of tricky jumping to do, and I'd rather not do that. Anyway, I dropped this right next to the Queena. So, oh, Adol, come here! That's convenient. I'm making something really cool right now, Adol. I want you to help me. You should totally help me. You're right making an charm? I'll say it anyway, I know that hurts. What? How do you know? I'll explain that the name of Queen's request spoiled the surprise. I've been outsmarted. Fine, I'll tell you anyway. I'm trying to make a beautiful charm for someone. That's why I'm looking for shiny materials. Looking for three Saurian scale. If you find any, can I have them pretty please? Are you making this for your boyfriend? <laughs> I don't know. Thanks, Adol. Alright. He's just gonna stay over there. We I think we've gained any fish for you, Showbill. No, we have! We have the diplomas in our kid on. Well then. And she seems happy, but that may not have been enough. Perhaps she wants a different fish. Okay, fine. Our kid on. Uh, 
she's not happy, but that may not have been enough. She wants a different fish. Well, I'm sorry, we are out of fish. We'll have to go without for now. Anyway, we've got some veggies to harvest. Only six. Man, all right, it's fine. This has been too soon. But I've already started, so man, he's probably finished. Eggplants. Oh, there was nine eggplants. What? It's nonsense. Um, okay. Anything. I guess. You're on. Like Graduna. Yeah, Gendarme is lousy with those damn Graduna. Looks like they're a lot like you for really quick to reproduce. Not safe to leave them to it. So, how about you thin their ranks? Count me on you. Alright. I don't think we have anything for the map. So, you have a request. Oh, my harvest. Ugh. Adel, sorry to bother you. You can tell that my, 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 ugh. I don't like this quest. You need to gather some medicinal plants for me. But the plants in question can... The plants in question can actually be found anywhere. Are the ones I need to truly... Oh, the fruit truly put in the medicine gill of the Okay. That second line made that make more sense. Unless I'm glowing during the day, so I have to gather them at night. Because of this unique feature, the plant is actually known as moonlight grass. How interesting. Uh huh. It's actually quite beautiful. I think you'll like it. I swear where you might be able to find it. Well, Thanatos told me that he's seen it growing around Gendarme. However, it's very dangerous for the average person to explore the area at night. It's dangerous for anyone to explore the area at night. So I'd like you to go there for me and find the plant. Can you not just hear me? Adol, stop saying yes! Thank you in advance. I think five samples should be more than enough. I know I'm asking a lot of you, but please don't push yourself too hard. After the night exploration at Gendarme, we are going to be playing this off as long as we can again. Simply because, oh gosh, it's a terrible quest. Why is we got creep down here with three ripe crewberry, coconut, and mango, and a single dragon tree treasure. Anyways, did you check the bulletin board? Weird creatures appearing in Rother Valley. I heard their bodily fluids can rust metal. The Rother Valley is rich with ore. We should deal with those creatures before it's too late. When you're prepared, come talk to me. So now we got to take back the Rother Valley. Let's talk about gather supplies. Do you get the materials we need to build the boat? You need 20 pieces of dirty lumber, 20. Uh, 20 thick hides, and 10 iron ores. Are you sure that's okay? Deliver materials. Gee, thanks, buddy. Now I just have to build her. I better tell your own advances about this, too. I'm hey, having fun so hard. Looks like we got all- Seriously, so hard. Are you having fun? All the materials we'll need for a while. No, it wasn't easy, so I really appreciate your hard work. I was literally saving my inventory. Wahaha! <laughs> now we can finally put it- Start putting it together. Seriously, so hot. Are you having fun? What are you doing? Never thought this day would come. It feels rather strange, actually. <laughs> we still, we still a lot of work ahead of us. Okay. Now's the time to start manning up. Still, this is a happy occasion. Yeah, we've come this far. So now we just got to see this through. And start slacking off at Exploration Array Battles. The real work begins now. Let's keep it up, everyone. Yeah! <laughs> that finishes that us great. getting supplies. We get a bandit bracelet. So a bandit bracelet is more defense. And we also get more items from drops in the harvest, so that's cool. I'm gonna go ahead and put that on Donna. Anyway, we need to begin a hunt because we need to take back the eroded valley. So that's level 42. Mm. 
complete at time. Um, Should have checked to see if we had this left for Queen. Oh, also, we need a we have a heal stone. We need to upgrade our weapons. Very important, actually. Let me give fancy charm. No, he's been super strict lately, so I can't get the stuff to make it. I need three starting scales. You have any? Can I have them? Can you please have them? No, we don't have them. Considering we got that scene, we don't have them. Hey, we got a fuel stone. Er, sorry. Fuel stone is the old name. Why does something go back? Flame stone. I'll put it into the forge at once. Fuel stone is what it was called before. Now it's just it's flame stone. So, can enhance weapons and more armor. Let's go ahead and enhance our weapon. So, Donna already started at the next stage, I believe. Yeah, it looks like. Um, makes sense considering we get the flamestone when we get Donna. So, anyway, I'm gonna upgrade I'll get started. our reforge. Ricotta and Hummel, right, I think. Finished. Leave it to me. I think that sounds like a plan since we are kind of tight on Tech Tide right, Orb. I don't want to do a huge amount right now. Anyways. I'll get Let's enhance Donna. All right, finished. What we need for five. This little by little. I don't, we can't do the full right, level finished. three for all three of them, but we can at least do something. I'll get started. Alright, finished. Leave it to me. Yeah, we can get. Oh, you pummel. It's complete. The mat. I'll get started. All right, so much tech to the ore. All right. All right, forge armor. We probably just burn all the tech ore though. No, no, we can make one. So I think, except for maybe Donna, I'd rather have. Oh, we have. We need one sorting scale for that quest. We need one for. <sighs> Leave it to me. All right, finished. We'll Leave just throw right, ourselves finished. one sorting scale. We should get more where we need them. I'll just give that way. Give oh, Rakota the Lamella armor. Is there any more quests? Because oh my gosh. No, there is not. Oh, hi. Adel. Oh, Adel, I heard we're finally gonna start building the ship. Please leave the still hanging of the sails to me. Are you in pain? My stomach isn't feeling well today. Ah! I also supported Allison and helped her onto a bed. He immediately informed Lick to check on her condition. Hmm, she's finally resting. What's wrong with Allison? Well... She's pregnant. What? R really? Pregnant? You mean, I'm gonna have a be a big sister? She's in the last month of her pregnancy, so she's due to give birth rather soon. No, she wasn't obviously shown, but how could I not have noticed? Don't blame yourself. I was hiding it. Why, Allison? My husband Ed and I knew I was pregnant before I ended up here. I just didn't want to cause pro a problem for everyone, but I guess it didn't make a difference in the end. You're not causing a problem. Adel is right. We would never consider you or your pregnancy a problem. Everyone in the village is one big happy family. We all rely on each other when things get a bit tough. Right now, your main concern should be your unborn child. You need to make sure you get plenty of rest, Allison. You guys. Hmm. Everyone is really happy for you. Allison, I think you could last because you've been working too hard. You need to stay rested before your baby until your baby is born. Do everything I can to make sure you deliver a healthy, happy baby. Sorry, I'm not a more experienced doctor, but no, you've been very helpful. I trust to take good care of me and my 
baby doctor lives. Adel, I've presented the clothing for you all before this happened. You know I won't be at the shop. Please take whatever you need. Thank you, Allison. Make sure you get plenty of rest. That's your top priority right now. Allison has been working really hard. I just wish her husband was by your side. He said his name was Ed. I hope we find him. We've searched this island high and low, though. Yes, we have no way of knowing if he even made it here. But it won't do Allison any good to get ahead of ourselves. Just do what we can for now. So, like she said, tailor goods are neatly arranged here. Take any you need in exchange for material cost of the item. But we can still get stuff that she would normally offer here, but we don't actually talk to her, we just talk to the counter. So, there are some new items here, but we can't exactly make many of them. Um, got soft gloves, prickly dam. It does up my defense. And adds poison, but more importantly, up to my defense. So I'm gonna go ahead and get one for both Sahad and Dakota. Donna's good for now because she got that, but. Anyways, we've also got Donna's regular extra outfit available out of here. We've also got Dandy Fisher. Start. Sure, let's get it. Also clean the card? Sure. Why not? Uses all our soft fibers, but give it to Dakota. Sure. Now I think we've done everything we can in here. Double check the bulletin board. Yep. So we need to Oh, we can get in there. Do that sometime. So... What's that? I think, where do we want to go first? There's only so much we can do. A lot of it's on Gendarme, like Moonlight Harvest, and Hunt for Duna. And that's in there. We can also get in there, because we have 18 people. But, oh, there's actually an event there. Maybe we should check that out. Ah, and... Sunrise Beach has an event, so let's actually head for Sunrise Beach. I had to think for a second where I wanted to go. It's like, there's a bunch to do, but there's also not. I know I should really put on the light, but I'm not, because I'm kind of silly like that, but I just don't want to change my setup for this one little fit. Alright, Sunrise Beach. So there's one main reason we would come here, and that is make sure you have a bright mango. And boy, they just gave us three of them. Yeah. Yeah. We've got Master Kong! I will train you next, Bluebeard. That's what he said. <laughs> must be talking to me. Be offer it. Sahad must fight Master Kong by himself. Yep, let's offer it. Alright, Sahad's turn. Well, that's the move that Sahad's gonna get. Oh my gosh. I'm taking a lot more damage than I did with Rakota already! Oh no, I didn't need to stock on healing! This is... a thing. Especially because I'm taking damage! We're gonna have to use all the rings in my potions. <laughs> so this does highlight one of the reasons I don't like using Zahad. It is so slow. <sighs> and I use potions just because 
would rather not. Hey, okay, I was definitely dodging that one. Do that, but unfortunately, yeah. it's actually the easiest move to touch. It's a special for pod one. Gotta take this more carefully than I used to. Okay, we might have to bust into the revive items. Come on. What? How does that even work? I must have just dropped down his invisibility for an like a long second there. Really? Come on, buddy. I sent her that back to me. Oh, it's fine. Oh, jeez. I dodged it, I just didn't flash and move it. Come on, come on. Oh my gosh, alright. Dragon Tree Fruit it is. What? Seriously, that is. Yes. I mean, at least as long as I can dodge, it's something. I guess it doesn't help that he's level 43 compared to my level 35 to odd. It just knows that part. Probably part of my issue right now. Why this is so painful. Nice and easy. Probably finish this off with a little flash move first. <laughs> okay, that's enough to be alive. Okay. Please finish him. Thank you. Oh my gosh, that was that was close. Ay ay ay. All right, I did it. The strange feeling. The hard learned Gale blow. What a nifty skill. Master says, I don't deal with rude people. We'll meet again on the shore near the odd shape rock. Yeah. See you later then. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well that takes care of Master Kong. Let's go back to Cat Boy Village and get healing items. Yeah. Shoot, he's not out here anymore. He's taking care of Allison. <sighs> all right, all right, fine. Well, it more of a trip to talk to him. Hello. All right, I'm gonna make one full potion, and then just 
Alright, steel potions. Seems like Please a good plan. Ahem! Oh, <laughs> we have healing items. Let's... I'm gonna wait for a little bit. How many minutes? One percent of gendarme. What the heck? I guess it was in that one cave, maybe? Um, anyway. Let's go... I guess that's, yeah. At its primeval forest is our closest one, so let's just go there! And just book it. And I totally didn't even notice that that guy was level 43. Oops. Actually. He is a higher level, so it's hard to say. None of them will get good experience off this. Let's let's go back to not fighting these guys. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm gonna have to fight stuff eventually. Because I don't wanna get it was low leveled. That would just be bad. Let's just head on through the Kangaya Plains and my main goal right now, even though, like I said, you can kind of do the egg delivery stuff right now, but it's a little complicated. I'm gonna head that way, sort of, but I'm not gonna fully do it. There's one key reason I am heading this way, though. Troublesome pillar blocked the way forward. Make a help request? Sure. They're saying, little pair, everyone cast away village, except probably Alice, and you'll rise to help. Okay, I'm gonna start on it. Yeah. Pumpo is clear thanks to everyone's help. Alright. This is the reason I wanted to come in here. There was a crystal in here. <laughs> Gives us a faster path to Pangaea Plains. It doesn't involve going through. Forest. Anyways, do these space to be drops on the trail? I wanna wanna be careful with fighting him, but I don't want to fight him. I want your scoring scales, that's all I want. Mew, stop hitting me. Burn scale? No, no burn scale. Fortunately, though, there is a pretty pissed off primordial on me, it looks like. So, let's just make our way forward, why don't and shall we? Yeah. And I believe. Head this way. Can we avoid that primordial? Let's examine this campfire again. How have we seen this campfire before? It looks like it was lit recently. Yes. Still smoldering too. Is the fire serving your vibe? Yes, that seems highly likely. Let's search around here. Alright. So what she means by search is actually just go back to the previous area. Because, well, I mean, that's what searching involves, right? Going past where you just came from? <sighs> that's not like how it works. Should fight you, but I'm not. Yeah, because, well, you guys still hit hard. Okay. 
Ia reckon has the fire starter? I believe so, but she appears to be much older than I expected. Oh my, I finally come across some other people. We were passengers on the Lombardia. I'll tell the old lady everything that happened since the ship was attacked. But we're on the Isle of Saren, I see. But all that has happened sounds like this key is within our reach. <laughs> what a delightful turn of events this is. Yes, yeah, so please don't worry about a thing. It's dangerous to be here alone. You should come with us back to the village. Look out. Where do you come from? Yeah, a beast! Don't worry. I'll take care of this. Huh? What does that mean? Coming. Oh. Ha ha ha, that ought to do it. Joyce, everyone, for tonight we feast! Um, who on earth are you? Ha, surprised? As I should formally introduce myself. My name is Sylvia. I was once a gladiator who last fought in the Roman Colosseum ten years ago. Pleased to meet you all. Hello, oh, Sylvia. I am not doing your voice like that, because... Because I don't hear older people talking like that. Seriously. Media always makes it out like that. I just... I don't hear it! Colosseum Gladiator, no wonder you're strong. <laughs> well, you're certainly a fearsome old bird. The way her silver hair flaps like a pair of wings as she swings that enormous blade. You must be the silver-haired hawk. Oh. oh, you've heard of me. Everyone has heard of the silver-haired hawk, the undefeated champion of the Colosseum. You're a legend among gladiators. Wow, you're amazing. You remind me of Master. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a long time ago. Now then, I think I'd like to join this village of yours. I'll make my way there right now. You guys be careful. Sylvia has joined Castleway Village. Of how she's the one saying be careful. It's like, you just rest. Anyway. Oh yes, we also need to go back for that. Let's actually do that real quick. Back into the forest. We're just here, but let's go the way we didn't go. Get some spark pulling mucus because we actually really need it for uh, fall potions. Seems like a good time to get it. Ooh. This is a nice spot and all. Oh, was this waterfall here before? Mm, I don't remember. Something must have happened near the water source to make it suddenly appear. Yet, this waterfall doesn't look like it appeared out of nowhere. This might be due to the waterway I repaired. You mean you did this, Donna? Wow, that's amazing. <laughs> well, so... Nice little look at how our actions as a Donna have consequences. Oh, it's not up here that I need to be. It threw me off. We need actually go down here. Pick up a black bracelet. What does said black bracelet do? That's dark. Sweet. So oh, now that's taken care of. Next. The hunt Graduna. Now let's do Graduna real quick before we call the video. All the side stuff kind of just opens up all at once. 
I know I said I was gonna wait to do this, but you know. Only by wait, I meant wait later in the video. Yeah. They really are just like theovers. They model and everything. Level 42, so Dawn is the right level at least. So they are just gonna come out in waves. Um, anything good on them? They drop mangoes. We're going on Donna. Fine. Okay, mango? Yes, actually, we've got a mango. Wait. New skill for Rakota. Should ideally level soon, too. And not before we switch, too. Come on. Literally, to level the next enemy after the swap. <sighs> okay. That's a Grudinus. We did it without healing. <laughs> I had to swap between characters. Let's go back to Castle Village, turn that in. Pull up a there. layer. No more Grudin, eh? Haha, <laughs> you're definitely no slouch. That's one more problem solved, then. And like usual, here's your reward. Mission complete. We Mission. pick up two defense elixirs. Not bad. I will definitely take some defense elixirs. Do you have anything new cool for crafting? You do actually. The well, Saint Ring has SP cost. So it takes items we have not even seen yet. So, don't expect to make any time soon. Also got Blade Ring 3. Hmm. Interesting. Along with a power wrist and red gloves. Well, come again. Take your time. Anything else? Oh my gosh, primitive meat. Well, Vivian Bitters. Also, the second uh, gift is available. We still haven't made one. And an empty bottle's in here. I think that's been there, but yeah. Anyway, what about the trade jewels? So, you'll notice now this Wheel of Eternity. We picked this up in Donna's side in the past there in that sanctuary area. We can now trade one prismatic jewel for a wheel of eternity. So let's go ahead and do it. Why not? It's right here. One jewel. So that's the thing. Like as you get items in the sanctuary, we'll be able to grab them off of Dina. I guess maybe she like salvages them or something. I don't know. But anyways that means we can now they will the train here, so some duration up random. I'm not gonna put it on for now, but it's here. So that's cool. Anyway, that is gonna do it for this part. In the next part, we will actually do some story. Since I'm putting off Moonlight Hunt, I don't care. I like to play. And I'm putting this off for a little bit to the egg delivery. Um, we need soaring scales, but we should be able to pick those up, I believe. So, I'm going to travel to the Rose Attorney and call it a video there. So, thank you all so much for watching. We have a cutscene. I just want to move here. Donna. Donna? Everyone. It's all right with you. There's a place I'd like where I'd like to visit. Fine by me, but where is this place? Up ahead, just through the Essex Tower. You better get moving. 
Thank you, Adel. It won't take very long. Let's get going then! Ah, <sighs> uh, where? This is where I met Thanatos. Something special about this place, Donna? Um, I feel like there's supposed to be a building up ahead. Hmm. There wasn't a building there when we first came here, though. Oh, I see. <sighs> Thanks, Donna. Well, anyway, as I was saying before Donna interrupted me, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. If you'd like to help support the channel, be sure to check out my Patreon, as well as the other general links in the description. And of course, if you'd like to find me on social media, you can also find those links in the description, Twitter, Facebook, Sometimes it's good to rest. You know the drill. So again, thank you all so much for watching, and until next time, this is Rindy and T, signing out. Let's go already.